Hello and thank you for purchasing your Archon Air Vent Auto Mount from Extreme PDA. This is uh, another instructional video on how to install a, uh, the air vent mount in your car. So first we're going to look at all the parts here. First we have the holder, which you can see here. Side arms are cushioned. The foot posts are positionable and with the quick release button it will pop out to put your phone in. You then put your phone in, squeeze the arms closed and it will hold your phone in there and it will not come out. Get it out, push the quick release button and remove the phone. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to show you how to put together the vent mount and this is the main part of the vent mount. As you can see, it's got a swivel ball head, which rotates 360 degrees. So if you had your phone in a portrait position, or if you want it in a horizontal position, you can turn the mount 360 degrees. This is the main body of the air vent mount. And these are the two posts or legs that are gonna fit into your actual vent. So first thing we wanna do is we wanna put it together. We're gonna take it, and you can see here, there's a little circle here. It's going to go inside there and you're going to push it over to one side. You're going to take the second one and do the same thing, except we're going to go to the opposite side. If I can get it in there. It takes a little pressure, but it's a solid mount. And there you have it. Push it all the way to the side. And it should click into place and there you have it. You see you've got your two legs, you've got your stabilizer leg here on the bottom, and the two legs will pinch open, which will let you easily put it on your vent or take it off. You can then attach the head to it, the holder, slip it up into place, and that's pretty much it. That's the mount fully assembled. And you can see that when you have your phone in it, let's say you have one of the new HTC phones or the iPhone. We use one of the HTC phones. Goes right in there and it can be swiveled into a horizontal position. If you wanna see your GPS in landscape mode or in a vertical position. Again, push the quick release and the phone comes right out. Now we're going to take this outside and show you how to actually install it in your car. Okay, we are now in the car and um, we're going to show you the uh, vent installation. As you can see here, these are my vents. They are kind of uh, thin. The, the space between them is kind of thin, but the, the mount will still fit on here. And what we're going to be doing is the actual legs of the vent mount are going to be connecting to those horizontal ones you see in the back there, if you can see those. It will go all the way onto the back of those and will actually clip into place via the small hooks there at the end of the, uh, the vent mount. Now, a lot of people call me up and say, well, my, 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 my vent is not horizontal, it is vertical. So what you'd have to do then is simply just turn your vent legs to be in a vertical position and it will fit onto a vertical onto a vertical mount. Okay? So right now we're just gonna keep it at a horizontal position. It's very tight. Okay. So you want to try and get one toward the top and make sure your stabilizer leg is in a good position here. What we're gonna do is we're gonna spread it open a little bit and you're going to pinch and then push it right onto the actual vent. And there it is. If you try to pull it out, it's locked into place. And on this particular vent, I don't need the stabilizer light because it's sitting in there very well. And that's, that's right there. That's the installation is complete already. So as you can see, the vent is still operational doesn't really block that much of the air. And if you try to pull it out, 
it will not come out because of those hooks that are in place. What we do next is connect the holder. And the holder is in place, and as you can see, it works very well in the vent mount. And what we do then, I've got the Droid Incredible here. We're going to put it in there, and your installation is complete. And you can turn that and view it at any angle, and like I said, you can turn it completely horizontal if you want it in a horizontal position, or turn it back and keep it in a vertical position. A lot of people worry about the heat from the vent or the air conditioning hitting the phone and disturbing phone. The phone is actually not close enough for any kind of damage to be done to the phone and as long as I've been using this kind of mount in my truck, never had a phone have a problem. And once you want to get out of the car, pop open the release and you're all set to go. Now removing the vent, the vent mount is just as easy. If you can look up here on top a little bit, all I do is press the legs open and it comes right out. So it's solid when it's in there and to release it, it is very, very simple. And that is the installation of the vent mounts. Thank you for watching and uh, hopefully you buy more products from Extreme PDA and check, up, check back with us for more instructional videos on more auto mounts. Thank you very much.